We're talking with Joe Hansen and Tommy Hagen, and they're here to talk about the 15th, is it 15th annual? Sow Bug Roundup. Sow Bug Roundup. Yeah. Celebration of fly fishing. <laughs> Celebration. Now, one year, I think when we first started doing this, somebody brought a sow bug. Tell, oh, us, what a, tell us what a sow bug is. Hmm? Well, what it is, it's a... Uh, is it an insect? It's a little black it, it, it's thing. It's a crustacean, <laughs> but it looks okay. like an insect. It looks yeah. just like an old roly-poly bug. That, but it's an underwater but yes. kind of, Is creature. it kind of fuzzy? It, it's that's its legs. Oh, that's it's, its legs. It's got Because Bob gave me yeah. one. It was just a little yeah. tiny thing. Uh, and uh, it's really in the Norfolk River a lot. Yeah. Mean, does it does it start out as nothing and mutate into something, or just it's just a sow bug? I think it's a sow bug the <laughs> okay. whole time. But they really are. Way past our pay grade now. <laughs> well, it's a crustacean, uh, so uh, yeah, yeah, it would be a sow bug. But they're bug. tiny. Yeah. Yes. But yes. trout love them. Yes. Mm -hmm. Okay. Well, that's really all that matters, that's right? right? So we don't care what it is. If trout love trout them, we're good them. to go. They do. Now, this, this celebration, I would call it because it's, it, it's uh, something to celebrate fly fishing, or is it because the sow bugs are, are ushering in the, the trout it, season? Is it sow bug season, he wants to it's, know? It's yeah. to celebrate fly fishing. We yeah. do this once a year. It's an uh, annual event. We bring in tires from all over the country and actually bring in folks from all over the world. And uh, mm -hmm. they come to Mountain Home, and we t show have demonstrations of a uh, fly tying, just have a good, good, mm -hmm. good time, good time. Well, this area is, is the capital of, of uh, trout fishing, supposed to be yeah, anyway. Yes. Is there any other areas that people have at events like this anywhere oh, else in the world? There's, there's lots of okay. fly tying events throughout the uh, country, mm -hmm. throughout the world actually, but uh, we like to consider ours as the friendliest and probably mm -hmm. the best, mm -hmm. uh, so. Well, you say you have people from all over the world coming in. I guess I guess they're here because of the area and, and the great fly fishing. Yes, and uh, we have some really big name fly tires. Uh, in fact, a lot of them are local people like Tony Spizio, who came up with the original idea for this sow bug roundup. Mm -hmm. uh, uh, he did that 15 years ago, mm -hmm. and he's actually going to be one of our featured tires this year. And he's he just uh, won a major award uh, for his fly tying abilities. He's kind of like in the Hall of Fame of fly mm -hmm. tires. Mm -hmm. And he's also a big bamboo rod uh, maker, and he's on the uh, Hall of Fame for that as well. Yeah. So he's he's a big name. We've got Earl Stanick, who's uh, world famous for his flies mm -hmm. as well. So mm -hmm. it's a huge event, a uh, lot of fun. Uh, you know, people can come and learn things mm -hmm. if they don't know anything about fly fishing or if they want to learn more about it or how to tie flies, how to okay. cast. Yeah. It's it's a great event. It's a multi-day event. Yes. It's three days. Three, three days. days. It's March 22nd, 23rd, and 24th. It's from 9 to 4. And this year it's going to be at the fairgrounds. We've kind of outgrown okay. our oh, location really? in the past, so we needed more. Okay. more. We're actually going to have more vendors, and uh, we'll have an equal amount of more tires. So it's going to be bigger and better, we think. Well, you so. started out at uh, Ramada Inn, I think. Yes. Did you not? And then you moved to the church. The Lutheran which, Church Yeah, which was a bigger area. Yep. Then you just grew, outgrown we that. We outgrew the church, and uh, I think we'll... People are going to be really amazed when they see this, uh, the layout we have, because mm -hmm. it's really unique. Mm -hmm. It's not like uh, the Conclave, which is another fly tying event in October here. It, this, is, this is more, uh, we demonstrate the <coughs> tire more and focus more on the tire mm -hmm. for this event than they do at the Conclave. But mm -hmm. it, it's going to be a fabulous event. Well, you'll have a lot of these uh, 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 vendors doing actual tying. And you can learn from them and actually buy wares from them also, is that yes, right? Yes, they sell stuff. A lot of times they uh, sell it a discount for uh, mm -hmm. when they're at a pr mm -hmm. uh, program like this. So uh, you can get good deals on things. We have raffles uh, and we have <laughs> auctions and you can get uh, some really high dollar stuff for mm -hmm. good prices. Mm -hmm. And uh, new this year, we're, we've got a, a De Wopsy Deluxe Fly Tying Kit and also a Rod and Reel uh, combo set that uh, we're going to uh, do as a, uh, oh. Uh, going to give it away? Uh, yes. Uh, what's a, that? a drawing. <laughs> a drawing. A drawing. Trying to come I, up I with had to think kids, on right? Saturday for uh, okay. children under 15. Now, you've been, you had been doing some uh, fly fly casting uh, tips and techniques for women. Is that still going to be there? That will still be there, be for men and women. Okay. We'll have that going on all the time. We also have seminars that will be going all three days, and there will be a schedule of those for all various and sundry things, safety on the river, fishing in various areas, mm -hmm. just all kinds of informative mm -hmm. things for everybody. And mm -hmm. then I think the thing I think is unique about it is the, the guys and gals that, 
that tie flies want to share their knowledge. It's not like they're trying to hide anything. They'll, yeah. they'll sit down right across the uh, table from you and show you exactly how they do it. And I'm a novice, so it's amazing to me to watch these mm -hmm. guys and gals do it. And they're they're very patient and very very good, very mm -hmm. very now, good. Is there one price where you can get in for all three days? Five dollars is the fee, and that does get you in all three days. Twelve wow. and under are free, and we really encourage children and, and young adults to come. It's a great opportunity to get introduced to fly fishing, and we want that. We're a, an older demographic, and we want some younger guns to take mm -hmm. our place. And mm -hmm. it's really fun to see these guys and gals that come. And they, they have a good time. There's a lot of gifts for them. And uh, anyway, we, we do everything we can to make, make it a, a fun experience for them. Okay. Uh, but it, it, it is, uh, this is our big uh, money raiser for our, the North Arkansas Fly Fishers, which is the organization that puts mm -hmm. this on. And, and w with that money, the, Right off the top, the first forty-five hundred dollars that we bring in goes in, out for scholarships for college students, uh, oh, nice. okay. and after that, then we we put the money to use for other things such as conservation projects and uh, other items like that to help the community as well as Good. keeping our uh, organization going along as well. Good. Good. Now, One of the, the neat past, things always food. I'm sorry. Sorry to over talk. Yeah. One of the things we did last year I thought was really neat. The North Fork Hatchery down here, which is a beautiful place for everybody to go visit if they haven't gone, we actually bought or helped buy diffusers for them. They're having trouble with that, so we, we donated money. We also donated money to build a pavilion up at Whitehall so that people, when they are fishing, will have a place to get off the river and have some shade or a place to have a picnic lunch or whatever. So we do all, and Joe has actually got a thing going right now. This In the next month or two, we'll start building some steps down into Cotter so they'll have better access to oh, the yeah. river down there. Okay. So That's cool. Mm -hmm. The event again is the 22nd, 23rd, and 24th, is that right? That is correct. Mm -hmm. And is that Thursday, Friday, and Saturday? Yes. It is. Okay. And uh, it starts yeah. around 9 o'clock. 9 o'clock and it lasts all day, I guess. Mm -hmm. Yeah, till 4. Till yeah. 4. Okay, now what about food? Because usually <laughs> there was food and you, so you could buy lunch yes. there. Yes, we'll, we will have food, we'll have uh, desserts, we'll have breakfast. Uh, so people can come and stay all day yes, long? Yes, they okay. can come and stay all day long. All the right. food is fantastic, as a matter of fact. That's, uh, it's funny, we got known for being a, g a great organization and having skills in uh, tying flies, but we also we have a skills for cooking. We have some great cooks, and mm -hmm. some of the wives make desserts and everything. So it's, it's, oh, cool. it's a good, good time. Cool. Good time. Good. Glad to see you guys here. Thanks so much, and hopefully it's a great event like it always is. And But uh, to let people know it's not at the church this year, it's down at the fairgrounds. It's at the fairgrounds. Okay. Okay. All right. One of the things we would like to thank, we've hit every person, every business up in this area for gifts for these things, and we want to thank the merchants. This is a big okay. event for, for the Mountain Home area. We think it's a big economic benefit for the community, but we do want to thank those folks that have helped us How many people does it bring in? Do you keep count of that or, it's, or not? It's probably uh, around a thousand people uh, attend. Uh, okay. But we've had uh, donations from 103 different uh, local uh, businesses. So uh, it's, that's that's great. it's very, really very supportive. That's great. Mm -hmm. great. Thanks, guys, Perfect. so much. Thank you all very much. Sal Bug. Sal Bug. Sal Bug. Sal You guys make things easy. This you're you're good guys. Right here. Well, Sal we're going to take a break, and when we come back, let's go. Who is next? I think we're going to talk with Sharon. Era. Go to Sharon. Uh, the, uh, the, that must yeah. be Sharon's husband's going. Sharon's next. Well, okay, <laughs> there we go. Bull Shields Food Pantry. Stay with us. <laughs>